In health news tonight, we've all heard of people with certain heart conditions having a valve replacement. Yeah, that surgery might sound a little scary, but as NBC Local 33 Jean Burns explains in this week's Heartbeat Report, it's less scary than it sounds. That's right, valve replacements have become almost commonplace for cardiologists of today. And while in the past that kind of procedure meant open heart surgery, most often today it's done without making a chest incision at all. We go through the blood vessels in, in the legs and go up to the heart, and we can then cross the, the valve that has a problem and then deploy a valve. It's called a transcatheter aortic valve replacement, or TAVR for short. Experts say the benefits of this procedure usually far outweigh those of open heart surgery for many reasons. Not only is it a closed chest treatment, but it takes place while the patient's heart is still beating, which eliminates the need for a heart lung machine. And almost always results in faster recovery times. So, most of the times now the decision becomes not if to do TAVR, but when not to do TAVR. And so, we try to do this as in, in as many cases as we can for individuals that meet the necessary requirements. For more information on TAVR requirements and the other treatments available in the CIS Structural Heart Program, just head to their website. We have a link to it in this story on BRProud.com.